Jesse the jellyfish began their journey as an egg that in two days hatched into baby jellyfish known as planula. Jesse floated around in the planula stage with all the other hatched planula for about 10 days. Like all of Jesse's siblings, Jesse went wherever the current took them. Jesse began drifting to the bottom of the ocean to settle on what happened to be a coral reef. They did this by attaching to a hard surface of a rock, becoming an attached jellyfish or polyp. After settling in, Jesse greeted their neighbors. Hello, my name is Jesse. I'm a moon jellyfish. What's your name? I am Sam, the sea anemone. Hey Jesse, you don't look like other jellyfish that float around. You look more like me. I am. I am a moon jellyfish. I just have a lot of growing to do before I'm ready to float around like the others. Oh. Okay then. Who is this new creature? Hmm. I am Manny the Manatee. Welcome, little one, to Rainbow Reef. We, we are, are the Barns. Nice, nice to meet, meet you. you. And, and welcome, welcome to, to the reef. reef. We are happy you are here. The water here is clean and there is always plenty to eat. Rainbow Reef is the best coral reef in the ocean. Thanks, everyone. I am so glad I found such a wonderful place to call home. It had been a few years of living on the reef, and Jesse had become an elongated polyp. Sadly, the reef was changing too. The food and the animals were more sparse, and there was a lot of trash around making everyone sick. Uh, hey Jesse, is it just me, or is it harder to catch food in your tentacles or what? It isn't just you. Things keep getting stuck in my tentacles, and I can't get them out. Hello guys, how are you? Wait, where are the barns? The barnacles were empty. Many left shortly after that. Too sad to speak, never to return. With scarce amounts of food, Sam and Jesse struggled to survive. One morning, Jesse woke up to Sam being taken by something unknown. Jesse tried with all their might to uproot from the reef to save their friend, but Jesse's struggles caused them to detach from the reef into several parts, and they could not save Sam. The unknown was a researcher trying to save the reef, and Sam too. The parts that Jesse broke into were immature jellyfish that are known as ephyra. These ephyra float around and grow for about four to six months. Jesse had been floating around the ocean looking for food and friends. It had been so long that Jesse was now a mature jellyfish known as a medusa. Jesse is now full grown, average size at roughly 10 inches in diameter. By using stinging cells in their tentacles to capture prey and ward off predators, Jesse survived by feeding on zooplankton, small fish, and other jellyfish. One day, Jesse was swept into a current and all of a sudden collided into another jellyfish. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to smack into you. <laughs> Smack. That's a good one. You're funny. What's your name? My name is Jesse. I am a moon jellyfish. It's nice to meet you, Jesse. My name's Jay, and I am just like you. Welcome to our group. Stay and travel with us. Okay, thank you so much. Jesse and Jay swam ahead to join Jay's friends. To Jesse's surprise, it was a large smack of jellyfish. They all welcomed Jesse into their group, and Jesse was so happy to know they were.